Welcome back to The Vault, everyone. This time around, we have something incredible from the creative, brilliant mind of Mr. Harry Lorraine. If you don't know who Harry Lorraine is, he is the world's foremost uh, authority uh, and memory expert, but he's also an incredible magic creator. And some of his card magic, I think, is the best in the world. It's my favorite material, and I'm thrilled that his student, Rudy Tinoco, uh, was given the permission to perform and teach you some of Harry's legendary card magic. So this is 4x4 by Mr. Harry Lorraine. One of the things magicians have to do is not only practice sleight of hand, but we also have to practice sleight of mind. Wow, how did you know that? Okay, and <laughs> as also poker tells. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna deal you guys a uh, few cards, and as you get those, I want you to mix them up so you do not uh, so I couldn't possibly know what the cards are. And then think of any card and remember it. Lock it in your mind. After you've got one in your brain, think of they're shuffled. Think of one and then shuffle them up again so I can't possibly know what it is and hand me back your cards. Hand me yours. Hand me yours. Hand me yours. All right, and I'm gonna mix them up again. Hopefully no dogs bark. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. Redealing them, okay? You're, these are gonna mix the cards up in a way where you're, whatever card you chose, is not gonna be in the same position that it was before. So I'm gonna turn these over, and all I want you to do is, I'm gonna show you each pile, and you're gonna tell me which pile contains your chosen card, okay? So let's start with you, Cheryl. You can tell me which card, on which pile contains the card that you are, at this point, only thinking of. Which? It's in that pile. This one here? Yep. All right. Gosh, okay, now I really hope this works. I, this has been incredibly difficult. <laughs> if I was Cheryl, I mean, we haven't known each other for long. Actually, a few years. I think you chose this card. What was your card? Seven of Spades. And it is the Seven of Spades. Wow. Man, I'm telling you, isn't that crazy, babe? <laughs> All right, Sean, your turn. Which pile contains your card? My card is in this pile also. All right, wow. Now that makes it much more difficult. Wow. All right, so I'm going to say, I know Sean. I don't, I'm not sure. Yes, this. What card are you thinking of? King of Spades. Oh my gosh. Babe, I don't even know how this works, but it works every <laughs> single time. All right, so now two left. Which pile contains your card? This one right here? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to guess if I was you, I'm going to go with this. What was your card? I wanted so much to impress you guys. That's why I have the King of Hearts. All right, so, babe, you are last but not least my lovely bride. That Which one. This one for sure? Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. All right, so, Ray, I'm going to do this the same way I did last time. So, humor me. I'm going to show her this card because using poker dust, we have to have somebody look at the card. So, look at that. Okay. So, I'm going to, I would bet... I'm not going to tell them what I'm going to bet you for on this, but I think that is your card, sweetheart. What is your card? Four of Clubs. See? I know what I get tonight. <laughs> <laughs> well, <Mind blown>. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Harry Lorraine. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs>